BlackBerry.com. So what we're showcasing here is the BlackBerry Mini Keyboard, and this is for Playbook. So as you can first tell is that it basically makes your Playbook a really ultra-portable computing solution. And we're really excited because, you know, a virtual keyboard is great, but there's a lot of scenarios where you just need a, a physical keyboard. Right. right. And the, one of the big benefits is that you, know, you can actually get the full screen real estate when you're actually typing. You know, you don't have the virtual keyboard to give up any space. You know, obviously the actual tactile feel and the uh, different functions you have on the keyboard. One thing really unique about uh, the BlackBerry Mini keyboard as well is we're integrating the touchpad into the keyboard, right. so it's an all-in-one solution. So not only is it for typing and inputting text, you can also navigate entirely around the Playbook OS. So I'll demo that quickly. So you can see here, I can actually single tap for a left click okay. and double tap um, with two fingers for a right click. So if I use two fingers, it actually invokes the Playbook bezel gesture, do the same thing there. I can switch between apps just by two finger tapping around the apps. So, and one other really cool feature is a two-finger scroll. So in certain applications, for instance, the, the email, the messages application here, I can actually scroll through my right. messages. So it's a very convenient way to interact with your applications and, and create the content you and want And if you to. feel like touching and swiping, you can still do that. Exactly. Obviously. It kind of brings you the best of both worlds. Right. right? So there's some scenarios where you might want to use, you know, the scenario where you're doing like, you know, using your fingers on the touch screen, other scenarios where you actually want to use the touchpad. And so we're really excited, and you can do the same gesture all around what Playbook can support, right? So even in the corners, um, you can go the top swipe to bring down your options. And what we're really excited to demo with the keyboard is, you know, certain applications, right? So we're, we're following this whole theme of one plus one equals three. So what we're really saying is that, you know, a keyboard is great, but when you actually you know, combine it, integrate it with a certain application. In this case, we're going to demo Citrix Receiver. It sure. really gives you a powerful um, solution that, you know, it's, again, the 1 plus 1 equals 3. You can do a lot more than what you would have originally thought if you just had a keyboard. So I'll showcase that right now. This is a, a virtual desktop powered through Citrix Receiver. And as you see here, I can navigate totally around the device with this touchpad on the keyboard. I'm going to Word here. I can type in, you know, the quick brown... Quick brown fox. What is it? Jumps over, over the moon. The that'd moon. That'd okay. be more impressive okay. than whatever it normally is. The, the fence. moon. So as you can see there, it's it's very very uh, responsive, and this is all ac actually accessing a virtual desktop, right? Right. So, so you're it's just all, going through Wi-Fi right exactly. now. Exactly. Right? And as you can see here, all the, the gestures are supported. And what's really cool is with Citrix Receiver and this keyboard, we actually support mouse right click functionality. Okay. Which sounds kind of you know basic at first, but you'd be very surprised how many platforms don't actually support that or support that in a very seamless way. So we're really excited. All you have to do actually is um, two finger tap and away you go, you got the right click. So it's very, very convenient, especially for, again, an application like Citrix Receiver where you're accessing Windows-based applications which are inherently kind of designed for mouse and keyboard. So we're really excited from that standpoint. And, and as you can see here, just the power with going through different applications, interacting with them like you would uh, just on your laptop or desktop PC. You know, go to Excel. So as you can see, I'm multitasking through a virtual desktop. I can also actual actually do some multitasking between uh, the Citrix app as well. So as you, as you see there, I just two fingers swipe down from the top. Right. I can access another application. It seems it's just Excel. It's a spreadsheet. Um, again, the two finger scroll applies here as well. So I can do two finger scrolling, go through you know, different things I want to see. The right click again is supported, so I can do you know enter a comment for instance and say you know. This is cool. This is pretty cool. Away you go. So yeah, we're really excited that you know, with combining uh, our peripherals, right? We have we demo BlackBerry Bridge with remote control functionality and Playbook OS 2.0. And you know, using your, your BlackBerry as a remote control is great, and we're seeing just peripherals in general really add to that experience. Right. Um, and so we're really excited for the BlackBerry Mini keyboard. The other thing I'll say about the keyboard is that. Not only does it have the integrated touchpad and the fully functional keys, and it packs up in a you know single case where you can kind of yeah, fold let's take it a look at this a little closer. And away you go. Um, it also actually is a secure Bluetooth link, so it's under over 128-bit encryption. So it's a secure solution for our enterprise. We're really excited about that as well.